Hello, Mountain Park Church. This is Pastor Melissa Wood here. I am coming to you to talk to you about this week's Bible readings. And I'm excited because we're in a series right now that emphasizes the way that our vision looks here at Mountain Park Church. And for five weeks, we're focusing on five different verbs that Mountain Park Church lives out and acts out for our vision to be fulfilled. So this past Sunday, I was privileged to get to preach on the verb share from the portion of our vision statement that says we are sharing our gifts with our community. And in that, uh, we talked about a number of different ways that we share ourselves because our gifts are not just spiritual gifts. They're, they're practical gifts. They're the way that we were created. Uh, our life itself is a gift that we can share with others. And so as you go through these Bible readings this next week, it's more of a recap of everything I talked about on Sunday, um, starting with Acts chapter 4, where we talk about how the early church shared everything they had in common, and then spending some good emphasis on 1 Corinthians 12 and 1 Corinthians 13 that does talk about our actual spiritual gifts and the way that we work together as a body and how love is something that is actually the greatest gift that we can give to one another. So I hope you enjoy going through these readings this week. Uh, I think it's so important for us to reevaluate. Are we sharing our lives genuinely, vulnerably, effectively? And if not, what are some of those roadblocks for us? Because our neighbors need us to share ourselves. The person in the pew next to us needs us to share ourselves. And sharing is such a vital point, part of being a believer and part of the Christian body. So the last day of the readings this week, you will see a passage that will lead us into our next sermon on the series, which will be preached by Pastor Greg, and it is on the verb utilize. So enjoy. <laughs> 